Hello, I'm back again for another video. Um, I'm just on a roll. Uh, let me see really quick if this light is any better. Uh, oh, well, I'll just go ahead and do that. It's it's afternoon time, but my my window my window is open, but it's just not. I don't know. It's just not the best light. I'll keep that on for now. Um, so I'm going to do a quick setup. Um, well, hopefully it's quick. Quick setup video of this week's daily pages in my A6 uh, Hobonichi, Hobonichi Original Tacho. Um, this is what I use for my morning time, like prayer slash spiritual journaling notes, that kind of thing. Um, I, uh, yeah, so I'm just going to go ahead and do that. I use the monthlies in here for gratitude. So I haven't obviously done December's. I haven't done today's yet. Um, where are we today? That's for 2025. Where are we? Right here. I've not done today's yet. And I, in fact, I haven't even decorated the month. I don't always decorate the monthlies. Like I didn't decorate last month's and I really didn't decorate. I did a little, this was from when I was briefly trying to use a different, I was trying to use a happy planner very briefly for my spiritual, um, which I done like three years ago successfully. And I just didn't, it, I wasn't feeling it again this year. So I didn't decorate for a couple months. July I put like a firework. Um, I didn't do anything first. So I don't always decorate these clearly you can see. Um, and there's not a lot of room, so I don't really worry too much about decorating them. But maybe I'll do a little something just because I'm here. So I um, use this for, I've got, let's see, I've got some, a little bit of washi tape. Maybe I'll just do like some holly, holly berries. Um, actually, where's, where's this? this? These poinsettias would fit. Oh, they're just a little bit too big. I'll do these ones. Um, I, uh, so I use this for my spiritual morning time journaling, whatever. I, um, I don't, so now that I'm working, especially, I used to like just have a big journal This uh, years ago, like have a big journal and I would just, I could just journal for hours or you know not hours but like I would journal maybe in the morning and then later I would come back to it in the evening um or in the afternoon you know I was a young new mom and I just had a lot of I was at home and I just had a lot of time and I would journal just pages and pages um and I love doing that and I've wanted to go back to doing that but the reality is I'm just not in sorry I'm just looking around to see where my seasonal my seasonal books are right here. It looks like or some of them. Um, and I just, I don't know. I'm just not in that season anymore. And right now I'm also working. And so having a designated page every day is nice because then I can have a little bit of time to jot down a quick prayer or to do a, um, to jot down a quick prayer or, you know, a note from a book I'm reading or something like that. And it's just, it's nice um, because then I can still get in that quiet time um, and some journaling. And is that too much, Holly? Yeah, I don't think, I think that's too much, Holly. We'll, we won't worry about that right now. Um, and it's just, it's just really nice to do because I don't have all the time in the world anymore. Um, I mean, obviously I never had all the time in the world, but you know what I mean. Um, so now, uh, I really am enjoying having a day. I really didn't plan this out very well, but what else is new? You know what? I'm just honestly going to leave this. <laughs> there we go. I've decorated for the month. <laughs> um, so, so because of that, uh, I don't always decorate. You can see in here, um, some pages are decorated, some aren't. Um, I like to leave a lot of, I don't like to always do a ton of decorating because I do like to have space to journal if I need to because the space is limited. But this last week I decorated ahead of time for the day before and then the day of Thanksgiving. And then I decorated for the day after and then um, the, the two days after Thanksgiving um, with more Christmassy kind of vibes or whatever. And then this is the dashboard page for the month of December. And then I just decorated with some extra journaling. And then, um, 
I put a quote there and then I just decorated it kind of Christmassy. And I don't know, I enjoy doing this. Um, and I've done this before, obviously, like in different days, but not a, not a ton. Um, you can see, not just not a ton. So um, I wanted to maybe for this week try something where I set up my week. Um, so just the eight, eight daily pages, the seven daily pages starting tomorrow, Monday through Sunday of next week. Yeah, the eighth of Sunday. So um, just so that I have my pages set up ahead of time and I'm gonna go ahead and grab really quick my white out and white these out. And I know I mentioned earlier that this might seem really wasteful, but it's just kind of what I do. And again, I don't, you, you can probably see, I don't do it on every page. Um, so while I'm whiting this out, I'll just do a quick, um, so I obviously, um, I am uh, Eastern Orthodox and I am devout. We're very involved in church and um, uh, yeah, we're really involved in church. Um, my husband used to be, before we were Eastern Orthodox, my husband used to be an associate pastor for a non-denominational like evangelical church um and we went to bible school right not long after we first got married so we've always just been like devout um i am a writer though and i actually um not that it even really matters oh no i ran out of white good thing i've got i've got extra um uh, not that it really matters, but I just figured I would mention this because I don't know a lot about my followers, to be quite honest. I know I've got a, like two or three family members that follow me and the rest are strangers, which is cool. Um, and thank you for watching if that's you. Um, but I just wanted to, uh, I guess, make a point really quick that I don't, I'm a writer and I don't, even though my faith is a very important, I mean, it is the most important part of my life. Um, at least I'd, I'd like it to be the most important part of my life. I don't write specifically Christian fiction. Um, I don't particularly, uh, I mean, no offense at all to anybody who enjoys Christian media, like specifically Christian media. Most, most of it these days tends to be, um, from an evangelical perspective you know, non-denominational evangelical Protestant background. And no offense to anybody who enjoys Christian movies, music, anything like that. I get it. Um, but I don't particularly engage with a lot of that media and I don't create that kind of, uh, I don't write Christian fiction. Now that doesn't mean I don't have maybe certain themes that come through or whatever, because I just think that's kind of inevitable as a, um, sorry, let me reach over here really quick. I have this old, ah, oh, it's broken. I have this old, um, I say it's old, it's not that old, but it's a lot of old, um, from my old, uh, I had a page where it was, um, not a page. I had a drawer that used to have a lot of my Bible stuff in it for my morning time and this was all in there and I'm I have some Christian or some uh Christmas stickers right here they were like Christmas like Christ themed Christmas stickers I guess I don't know there's not really that many and I don't actually know if I want to use these to be honest I don't really have a lot to go with so maybe I won't use those actually um Anyway, I don't do, uh, my faith is my most, is the most important thing in my life, but it's not, um, I don't, I don't, I don't know how to say it, my art, <laughs> I guess. And again, it's not that I, that I am afraid of it or don't want to share it or anything like that. Cause I do, it's just not what I create. Um, and so I'm just, uh, but it is a major part of my life. It's just not. I just don't write that kind of, um, I have these washi tapes that I'm thinking about using. Um, maybe this, these like muted vintage colors, ah, it's running away. And then I've got this really bright gold, which I think is a little bit much to be honest. I kind of like the idea of those colors together, but I don't know, it might be a little bit much. Um, I also am thinking about maybe just doing wintry on these pages. I don't know, they don't all have to match. And that's the thing too, with these daily pages, they don't all have to match. So maybe, 
like maybe here for tomorrow, I'll just kind of do a couple things. We'll just kind of have fun. I'll just put down these boxes. Um, because I want to leave room for myself to write. Um, to journal and write and stuff like that. So, oh, that one, I'll do this red one. That's cute. Cute. <laughs> um, anyway, none of that really matters. And I don't, I don't mean to, I don't even know if I necessarily need to share that, but I guess it's just something I wanted to say really quick. If you're just tuning in and you're like, oh, she's going to talk about, she's going to try to proselytize or whatever. <laughs> it's not my, it's never my intention. Um, it's just, uh, it's a major part of my life. Um, uh, I love my faith. Um, but I just don't, that's not the kind of, I don't write Christian fiction. Um, and I don't read Christian fiction. Uh, I actually, and I don't really know if I've talked about this a whole lot, but I actually tend to be drawn toward more like spooky fare. I actually write, um, I, I wish I was cool enough to say I write horror. <laughs> um, I write attempts at horror. <laughs> Um, so, uh, but I actually do enjoy reading spooky or fair. I love speculative fiction. So, um, specifically more so like weird fiction. Um, I really like, okay. So I think that's good for that, that day. I think this actually guys might be a shorter video. Um, oh, here's some wintry ones. I'll do, where did it go? Right here. These are pretty ones. Um, let's see. I, uh, I, hot cocoa weather. I'll do some holly, maybe. I, um, I'll just kind of go like that. Just kind of right there. Um, yeah, so I actually tend to enjoy spookier fare. And, um, I, uh, like weird fiction. I like fantasy, sci-fi, horror. Those are kind of my genres. I don't, um, when it comes to horror, I don't like like super graphic, like, um, like I don't like gratuitous violence just for like gratuitous violence sake. Um, but I do enjoy spooky stuff and, uh, I don't like, um, I don't typically go for like spicy things. Like I don't, I, I always check the parents guide for like movies before I watch them because I don't like a lot of sexual content. Um, uh, but other than that, like, um, I don't mind violence if it's in a movie or a book or whatever. Um, and I don't mind language or that kind of thing. I just, it's just, that's just not stuff that, um, really, you know, gets to me, I guess. Um, it's more so I don't, like I said, I don't like strong sexual content and I don't care for like gratuitous vibe. Like, like if you're familiar with, like, I think it's funny I'm talking about this while I'm setting up my like prayer journal, but like if you're familiar with movies like the Terrifier series, that's like not my thing at all. Like I, I've never seen any of those movies, but I watch a lot of like horror analysis videos. Um, I, you know, and I just, I know a little bit about obviously that culture and I'm just like, mm, not my thing. Um, but I love, um, I love, uh, I just love spooky stuff. I always have since I was younger. Ah, that's like ripped. Oh, I must have already tried to use that at one point. I'll stick this here. Oops, I guess that's where it's going. Okay, so just kind of a little bit of decor. And sometimes I don't have to do this, but sometimes I do like to do the spread, um, similar just because so it kind of goes even though they're different days um so i'm just doing a little bit of christmas i've used this book a lot lately and i like that book a lot but i'm gonna hold off because i don't want it to over overstay its welcome um in fact you know what i'll do this is actually where did it go this is actually a fall book but i'm gonna grab this because even though it's fall i feel like there are some wintry things kind of yeah, like this, hmm, like there's a, actually, the one I'm thinking of, if I haven't used it yet. Um, so anyway, I don't know why I was sharing all that, I guess. Oh, there's like a wintry one. That's cute. <gasps> so cute. 
But then there's also oh, this one right here. This is so cute. Let's, let's try this one. That is a really cute one. And then this one maybe will stick right there just because it's cute. So we kind of match those mommy deer and such. Um, uh, oh, this one, oh, that one's really wintry though, but that's really big for this, um, for this size paper. So I might hold off on that, but this is cute. Let's see, I've already used, <laughs> I already used that one. Hmm. Don't want to do too much of that then. Are there other boxes I could use? The forest, I don't know. Stay cozy. This is a Saturday, so that's a good one to maybe write like stay cozy, thankful, grateful, blessed. Um, I don't know where I was going with all of that. I guess I was just chatting because this is my spiritual one and I haven't really done, not, I've done um, videos that focus when I was using a commit 30, I think I did a video about, well, in heck, some of my earlier videos, like I have a Bible flip through and I have a, um, you know, I have a Bible flip through and I have a Orthodox planner set up, um, video. Uh, I think it was a setup. I'm not really sure if it was a setup video or what, but anyway, so it's not like I've never acknowledged it before. I feel like I mentioned my faith a lot, but I also know I'm going, I want to start doing a little bit more writing and planning content. Um, and I guess I just felt the need to maybe acknowledge that because I know some people get a little weird when it comes to faith stuff. And I, I get it if it's if you you know if you nobody wants to watch a video of um nobody wants to watch a video and then be like preached at right and I just want to I guess I just wanted to acknowledge like that's not what I um that's not what I'm about that's not the focus of my videos or of my um writing or my planning or anything like that so I guess just I guess there was a part of me that just wanted to share that as I'm trying to do a bit more video stuff I don't know if I have a use for this little guy because <laughs> I don't feel like it matches that page I feel like it matches here maybe we'll just set this here there we go there we go I'll find a use for him I'll put something in there um and then maybe I'll find some trees and put those down here um here we go I want the bigger thing the trees are smaller I'll do smaller just have a little bit of extra room so anyway, all that to say, I guess I just wanted to share that. Like if anyone was curious, if they're like, oh, she's doing her spiritual one. <laughs> um, ooh, should I do more trees up here too? Is that too much? I think I'll just leave that as is. That's just cute. Okay. I would love to have a box, another box here. I just don't know. There's like this one with the trees in it, but I just think that might be a bit much for the whole spread. This is kind of cute. It's not very wintry though. Mm. But here's the thing, when am I gonna use this? Perfect. Oops. Um, so uh, yeah, so anyway. I, um, I, and I'm also saying that because I think I'm going to do, maybe I mentioned this in a previous video, but I actually think I'm going to do a, um, a, like an author tube, like a, like an author tube Q and A type thing. Um, there's a list of questions that I found from another YouTuber and I'm like, oh, I want to do that just kind of for fun. Um, love this day. You know what I wasn't thinking? I forgot. Oh my gosh. I totally forgot. I printed this out. The uh, December 6th is St. Nicholas Day. And I printed out a little icon of St. Nicholas. See, look, I was talking about nonsense that I didn't need to, that nobody probably even cared about. And I <laughs> forgot what I was doing. Um, so now, let's see. I wanted St. Nicholas Day. Oh, and that's Perfect. I could, let's see, maybe I'll put him right there by the trees. We'll do that. Um, and so, uh, anyway, I don't know what I'm saying now, but I'm basically just prepping all these pages to journal in before I have to go to work every day. And, um, 
look at that purple. What is the purpose of purple glue? Does anybody know? I guess I get if it's for little kids so you can like see where you're gluing and then it dries clear. Um, and then here's a quote from St. Nicholas. And I was gonna put this in too, but now I don't actually know if I'll really have room. I could tip it in though. I might just do that. Um, I do have a page that's like kind of uneven, but um, I have a page actually December 19th, I think. I already had put in, um, I know the 20th is St. Ignatius, his feast day, and he's the patron saint of our church. And so um, I did an icon of him and a quote from his, from him. Um, yeah, this might just have to be a tip in if I do this. Maybe I'll tape it like right there so it can lift up. Maybe I'll do that. I could put it there, but then it covers the deer. Maybe I'll do that. We'll just do that just for fun. Okay. Ba -ba 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 -ba. What am I doing? I'll just do regular tape. Oh, that's too long. Oh my God. So yeah, basically I just like to get these, ah, uh, see that's too long, so now I'm gonna have to cut this down. What a horrible problem to have. <laughs> just kidding. Oh my gosh, come on. There we go. Such a, it's a silly thing to care about, but okay, there we go. So I have a little tip in, and I, I don't need to do this, but I do like to sometimes add a little bit of extra tape underneath just to kind of solidify and keep it there. It does make it a little bit thicker, but that's okay. Okay, and then my last page, I put this here just so I wouldn't keep decorating. My last page is the eighth, and I'm gonna go ahead and do, I've already done both of those books. Do I wanna do, I could do my Christmas dinosaurs. <laughs> um, actually, that's kinda cute, maybe I will. I'll do the red one because then the other ones are all kind of different colors. And I might want to put them in a spread. And so I'll save the blue one for a spread. Come on, little guy. Anyway, if you've made it this far, sorry, this is already going longer than I expected. We're at 22 minutes. Holy cow. I was like, oh, this is going to be super short. And it wasn't, guys. It wasn't. There we go. Nothing, nothing says prayer like a brontosaurus. All right. Um, we'll add a little, some snowflakes in here. Um, so anyway, beautiful, lovely. There we go. I have decorated my week for, um, before work and stuff. So I can just get in. I mean, it's the weekend too, but that way I can just go in and, and have some pre-decorated pages and focus on getting things read and, you know, written down and such. Um, and the week is decorated and it's all kind of different. And I've got some pages ready to go. Um, the cover for this, I ordered a new cover for this, I think I shared, and it is coming in, um, uh, it should be coming in Wednesday, I think. I ordered it from the Hobonichi website. It's the first thing I've ever ordered actually from the Hobonichi website. And I'm excited to get it. Okay, come on. Um, I'm excited to get it and set it up. I also ordered a sticker from Etsy to put on the cover um, of the cover. And uh, then this will have its little cover for the rest of my time using it. And that'll be nice. Um, that'll be nice to have. And then I can store it away. I won't get a ton of use out of it, but, um, it'll be nice to have. So anyway, um, if you've made it this far, thanks for watching. Sorry, this was a really kind of random all over the place video that didn't really have much of a purpose, I guess. Um, other than that, I just wanted to make it because I've been on a big video kick. Um, so thanks for watching. Uh, I hope you have a lovely start to your week. I will probably slow down with my videos, um, this next week just because I'm back to work. Um, but maybe I'll try to make a video a week or something like that. We'll see. We'll just see how it goes. 
Um, I'm just having fun right now, and uh, it's just been a nice creative outlet for me over, over the course of Thanksgiving break. So now we're kind of getting back to normal for at least a while, and then I'll be on Christmas break. Um, but uh, yeah, sorry this was kind of a rambly all over the place video, but again, thanks for watching if you've made it this far, and hope you have a blessed day. All right, bye.